Welcome to Totally Awesome Outdoors. This is just a quick review video of a piece of bushcraft kit that I got recently um, that I really, really like. And this is was given to me by Tim from Blue Angelical. Tim makes all kinds of things bushcrafty from leather tinder pouches, other general um, Sami style oil skin pouches, uh, little bushcraft seats, bed rolls, you name it, Tim's probably got it. He's very, very good at his work. So these are the Sami style oil skin pouches that Tim makes and they are handmade by Tim of some really high quality oil skin. Just they come in three different sizes, there's a small, a medium and a large and you can use them for anything really. You can put um, your tea, tea bags, coffee beans, anything like that, small bits. Maybe you uh, take some nuts on, on the, your trips in the woods or even just foraging and when you're collecting things you can put them in here. It, you can tell there's a handmade touch to them. They're finished with little brass rivets and some kind of brass antiques eyelets which are really nice, I think that's a really good finish to them. They've got a little um, Made in Britain tag on it as well which I quite like with kind of a crown there. Just the small things, kind of a nice small touch. The pouches are closed using paracord, just some black paracord and a plastic toggle there um, which pinches it tight and keeps it all shut. Obviously you could probably put your own cordage on here if you wanted to but I quite like the fact that you know that can pinch it tight and nothing will fall out. Um, and actually I use this small one for Jacks, my little puppy, my Jack Russell puppy, I use this for his dry dog food um, and it's really handy, it keeps it all waterproof. I take it out for walks all the time and he actually knows now that this is his pouch so every time I get it out he starts begging for food. But I really like these pouches and I, I do actually use them really often out in the woods and just on walks when I'm collecting things and foraging, you know, berries and things like that. I do use them very often and I'll pop a link in the video description to his website so you can actually, you know, uh, browse through and just see some of the incredible handiwork really that he does um, and it's always nice to you know not buy mass produced things when something's handmade you know that it's been made with that passion and that dedication and you can just respect the item a little bit more than you would if it was mass produced um, so anyway that's the Sami style oil skin pouches the Sami tribe are actually uh, one of the last kind of native tribes in uh, Lapland I believe and they used um, oil skin reindeer skin I think I believe to make their kind of oil skin pouches and items like that um, and it's actually really interesting there's a few documentaries around on this Sami tribe um, and how they use their reindeer herders basically um, and just they use their reindeer hides for so many different things um, and obviously it's waterproofability and things like that is and it's very tough it's very durable hope you enjoyed watching the video please check out my bushcraft playlist where there's lots more videos on bushcraft i'm actually here in my bushcraft camp today um, and please check out some of the camp update videos where i've basically been given permission in a woodland to build my own camp really and uh, to any style that i like and it's been a real good adventure making the camp and you can follow i think i've done about eight videos so far i'll pop all the links to the videos um, in the video description and it's coming along nicely there's lots of work still to do in the camp but now that i've got jacks my little jack russell puppy here who's four months old he's a bit of a terror um, and obviously we're still working on training and things like that so i can't necessarily do big fires and things that you know things like that so, too long because a the weather's getting colder and b he gets distracted very easily so it can be quite difficult but he's going to love coming to the bushcraft camp and doing some bushcraft lovely just a nice burp there from him and um, yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. Ooh. Why do you?